Thank you, Romato. Um, we have a hype match, hopefully, coming up. We have Jeff Compass versus Ombo Shore. Sorry for butchering his name all freaking week. Kill me, it's French, whatever. I'm not French. Ombo versus Jeff. Uh, we have C15 Jeff versus C18 Ombo. Um, now, I've played both of these guys, and they're both pretty good. I played Jeff, and I won 13-8, and I played Ombo, and I won 13-11, but Ombo should have won that. And I've talked to Ombo, and he said he's played Jeff multiple times, and Jeff currently has the winning record over them. Like, 4-2 to two or something like that. So, it's going to be a close match. Are we uh, live? Yes, we, we, we've been live. Okay. Uh, Hello. One disclaimer before we start the match. Ombo does not have a capture card, so you're going to see a lot of TV shake. <laughs> and his screen's a little bit tilted, so Romato is doing the best he can with, uh, with the crop thing. So, but hey, it's a screen, and it's pretty good quality. So you guys are going to have to live with it. But so once the, uh, once the runners are ready, we will get this match started. Did you mention uh, the seating? Yes, I did. Okay. 15 I, versus 18. I, I missed the the intro. I'll let you do all of Airstrip then. <laughs> it's only fair. Oh, are they both not starting with memory cards in? Bold move. Uh oh. Well, good luck to them. All right. Oh, we don't see any game overs. No more game overs. Card time. Card time. All right. So. Here. Column one sucks. I saw that. I we have oh, five from Bianco, four oh, from Pasta, four from Serena, and then over to the right is four from Noki. Oh, it sucks. It you does have two Shadow Mario goals. You have Shadow Mario and Bianco and Shadow Mario and Pinna. Uh, I see two bloopers. Uh, five from Enemies works okay with 23 from Rico. There's four and five. This is a three. weird card. This is a weird card. There's three boss shines, two bloopers on it. You also have the five enemies, which mean Rico is pretty good here. Um, five shines in Bianco is just not worth all that trouble. No. You have four it, and five red coins, which makes Bianco not as garbage. But Bianco still doesn't seem great here outside of like PD and then going to Rico to get the bosses. Yeah. Um, you have... Th Three totals on here. You have the 45, the 60, and the 80, which is like kind of sucky spread. <laughs> I didn't even know there could be three totals goals. According to Ramado, every card will have two guaranteed total uh, goals on the card, and then one out of every five cards will have a third total goal on there. Mm -hmm. uh, 100 from Serena, 20 from Serena. You have the 200 coins. Deal. Two from five. Four spray list. <clears throat> Eight from Delfino. Basket blues or pin basket blues or four fruit ladies. Twenty fives. This card sucks. <laughs> this card actually sucks. I'm glad I'm not five. playing this. Five secrets. Five secrets by itself is also bad. Yeah. This card I mean. Sucks. You go all the way through Bianco, you go all the way through Pinna, you don't even finish it, but, I mean, there's a free secret in, secret in Gelato at any point. Shit. Shit, I guess you just, like, do Bianco, Rico, and Pinna on this card, and then make your way to Serena or Noki? I, I don't see, other than that. four shines of Pianta, I don't see a single Pianta goal. Yeah, no birds. Nope. No links. No. Rockets or turbos? I don't know. Rico is like kind of the best option on this card, just because you have three bosses, two bloopers, twenty-three from Rico, um, five you, from enemies. 
Five from enemies. Rico's really fast as well. So, you, and you can easily get a good number of the blues. This is like hard shine progression card with like some amount of blues just kind of sprinkled in, which kind of sucks. <laughs> <laughs> um, yeah, I the blue goals that are on here, except for 45 and I guess 60, are not short. No, like tw 23, like Rico is really fast blues, but 23. I wouldn't say short, especially if you don't know the infinite wall kick trick. Yeah, if you don't know Kenny Kicks, 23 and Rico takes up till Rico 3. Um, 20 blue coins in Serena. Apparently, you need to go to Serena 7 to get that, so. No, uh, you need. That would be for 25. You only need 4 for. Yeah, no. For, for snipers, 20. You need to go to Serena 7, so. Oh, oh, that's what you're talking about? Yeah, that's what I'm talking about. Okay, I'm, I, I'm never, I didn't see I'm, Sniper's match. So. For for the remainder of this tournament, I'm not going to let that go. Sniper got 23 coins from Serena. Oh, that's funny. Okay. Um, I guess Bianco is feasible in this card just because you have five Bianco shines, defeat Channel Mario, four reds, five reds. The only reason anyone would be entering Gelato is for the secret. Secrets, yeah. Gelato is only for a secret. I guess, I guess you could get the Cataquack there. Uh, well, yeah, and um, maybe some blues, but maybe, maybe some blues. I don't know. This card just kind of sucks. <laughs> it's like not fun because there's not a lot of synergy on this, and you kind of have to just like stick it out to some of these suckier goals, which is just like sitting through Rico and then sitting through Bianca and then sitting through Pena and then sitting through Serena. These are the cards you don't want to see when you're playing in like an official match. Like this is the this is the card you want on scrim week. So you can like <laughs> play these shitty cards and then you go like, man, this card sucks. Now I know what to do next time though. But when you actually have to do this in a match, it's a lot harder. Um Yeah, honestly, I would go to Bianco, get Bianco two and three, and then maybe four, depending on how I feel. I don't know. <laughs> Because I don't want to straight rush Bianco because Rico is kind of important here for the blues, the bosses. Um, you could get significant. You could go for five in Bianco, I guess, and then guess, just have that in your back pocket. Depending on what you, you have value, all, you have a lot of stuff in Bianco that could work to your advantage, like the reds, um, the blues, and obviously yeah, defeat Shadow Mario. Depending on what you value, I guess Bianco is more important than Rico. But depending on how badly you want to get to Pinna. For the basket blues, Pinna for spray list, red coins, Shadow Mario and Pinna, Serena shines if you don't want to do Serena whenever is all freaking match. Um, getting to Pinna relatively quickly. You don't have to straight Pinna rush. I don't recommend Pinna rushing on this card, but getting to Pinna at a decent rate is important. So Rico is definitely a better option to get to Pinna first instead of Bianco. But I don't know. It depends on what you value out of this card. This is tough. This is one of those the harder cards to route. Well, Combo making his way towards Beach Shine. So that's the that's the generic Rico rush while Jeff is opening Bianco. It's indicative of not going to Bianco. See, Jeff's gonna go for the the first blue you get in one twenty. Got Jeff blue. Good job. Yeah, I don't know. This card just I'm not a fan of cards like these because they're tough. <laughs> I'm bad at routing already, and it's just you, on this kind of card you have to like kind of partially commit to everything and nothing at the same time, which is annoying. I see cool. some benefit in going to Serena where you could get lives there and combo the 100, 100 coin with the 20 blues and obviously yeah. the 4 from Serena. But that's really... I can't see anyone starting that way. I Maybe recommend if, starting Serena. Yeah. It's, it's fine if you get Serena your is very... Yeah, 
I mean, if you get Yoshi, then the issue is no if you want to grind lives in Serena, you need to go do another an extra Serena whenever, and then you're end up doing like at least five if you want all that, which is just not fun. <laughs> so, yeah. Let's see. Ooh, neither Jeff, entering Jeff, Bianca right away. Jeff opting to now start doing uh, Underbell with a coconut that is a little too close to the wall while Ombo is making his way through the Bianca chase. Jeff, you need to like line up your jumps a little bit better, my guy. Oh, giving up on it. <laughs> he gave up on it and wants to go do Pachinko. Well, that is a red coin, so you technically are get Oh. If Come on, Jeff. Assuming he can get in Pachinko. <laughs> That's going to make it. Yeah. Beautiful, beautiful pepper clip by Ombo. So Ombo looking to start Rico here. Well, Jeff kind of half decided to come back to Rico now, but he couldn't do Underbell, so he gave up on that and went to go do... Pachinko, which is honestly not the worst idea either. I don't even fault him for giving up on that. If you're, you know, nerves or you're just struggling with simple t tricks, go find something other else to do and come back to it later. Yeah, sometimes mm -hmm. things that you know you can do just don't work for some reason. Like honey skip. Like a lot of things. <laughs> like a lot of things, but like honey skip. Like name anything in this game. Meanwhile, Amo grabbing some blues, grabbing a blue, not some blues, grabbing a blue while opening Rico. Jeff having a little bit of difficulty with his last coin, but looks like he'll get it. He's going to have to go through one more spring cycle. Oh, is Jeff trying to do like a, a Rico into Pachenko? Amo going for Pachenko with Rico Sorry, opening. I yeah, I didn't mean to say Jeff. I meant to say Ombo. If that... Does that work? I don't know if that works. <laughs> I've never seen that. If it does work, that's awesome. I've thought about that, because I know you can like get in there while you're doing the, the Rico stuff, but I don't know if it actually like finishes the Rico thing. The, uh, the Rico unlock. Jeff doing Chuckster. So we're only seeing Delfino shines. Perhaps both are rushing Penna. Yeah, that didn't work. <laughs> that's a, that's a minute gone off Ombo. I don't even know why you'd go for that. It only saves like ten seconds. Now you lose a minute because of it. <laughs> Meanwhile, Jeff now opening Rico as well because he didn't do the standard Rico rush route, so they're practically even. <laughs> One red apiece. They have the same amount of... Actually, they don't have the same amount. Yeah, Ombo uh, has one, more... one more shine. One more shine via beach, but... So is Ombo going into Rico now? If so, why didn't you just go into Rico the first time? Yeah, there, oh. you can do it. You can do it. There you go. Why did you do the stupid? I, I don't. Pachinko. Unlock early nonsense that I don't think even works because it doesn't. I You might be able to make it work, but it has to be like a frame perfect ground pound to get the cutscene to start. I don't think it works because it doesn't finish that cutscene out like how you, when you enter Bianco. Yeah, I was thinking Plant Chinko is a thing, but I guess I mean I that that starts like a, a legit cutscene versus just a like oh look Rico open cutscene. Yeah. So meanwhile, they're both in Rico one now. They're both doing blues. I think they both collected two blues: the jail blue and then the M on the wall by Rico. So. If they want 23 in here, they'll be at 25 by the time they're done. Ombo, very smart, grabbing the life in the box there. He's going to slowly work his way up to 20 lives. 
having knowledge of where the various one-ups are is pretty important in bingo, especially with these lives goals and just grabbing those ones that only take like two to three seconds to grab is can be pretty important over the, the course of a bingo. I like Jeff's route here. It's not, it's not a, what I normally see, but. So I don't, I don't think Jeff knows how to do kinney kicks. I would not know if Ombo knows how to do it. I don't think he does though. I'm pretty sure they both don't. Which honestly, at this rate, it's not even really worth to go for 23 in Rico one because you still need to progress through Rico anyways to get <laughs> to get both bloopers if you want that in a secret. So. But yeah, right now they're just both collecting blues. It's going to be quite some time before a goal gets clicked off. Um, Mambo in the lead with a few more blues than Jeff right now. Oh. Come on, Mambo. There you go. Ooh, Ombo going for full rush. She's going to get the M's way out there while Jeff starts the blooper fight. I believe if you don't go for the wall kicks, you could get it in Rico too. Because if that's the only coin you ignore, then you get that new one in Rico 2, and you can replace it with that. He's only going to grab one of the M's. He's not going to get the one way up there by Rico 8. All right, then I don't really understand that. <laughs> Interesting. So, Ombo has more blues, but Jeff is farther along in Rico. I don't think I've ever seen a, bl a Rico blues quite like that, but... um, Yeah, Jeff in the lead for two bloopers if he wants that. While Ombo is still collecting some more blues during the fight, which is always a good idea. You can always grab this M while Mr. Blooper is resetting for hit number two. Mr. Blooper. Mr. Gooper Blooper. Does he have a middle name? I don't know. Rico? Gooper R. Blooper. Gooper R. Blooper. GRB. GRB, yeah. Yeah, Ambo has 16 and Jeff has 14. So Jeff down two coins in Rico right now, but he can make that up right right here with the Rico two entry. Normally though, if you don't get the 23 in one, you would get it in three with the enemies. I thought he missed that. Snags both of those coins. Yeah, Ombo going all the way for the the M without actually fully committing to the 100% rush, I think might cost him the goal. Because that M is slow. It's pretty slow. <laughs> I always try to avoid going for those two. I basically only ever go for those M's if I'm rushing 15 M graffitis at the start of a match. That's like the only reason why I would ever go out there. Yeah. Yeah, Ombo needs to find five more coins, which I can think of five off the top of my head right now that he doesn't have that he can get in Rico 3. So, But if Jeff straight rushes it in Rico 3, he might be able to beat Ombo to it. Nice blooperless movement. This is the first time I've ever seen Ambo play, so... Ambo's I'm pretty interested. good. He has a 126 on the leaderboard, but he said he got a one a high 120 the other day offline on GameCube. <laughs> yeah, he has, he uses GameCube. Which um, is even he, worse on loading. He uses German route, where that does Bianca 6 That's uh, immediately. Losing three seconds uh, to event cutscenes, let's go. 
and he does 5 YG. You got a 120 with a 5 YG? Yeah. Bro, you're nuts. I'm washed. <laughs> Jeff also going to grab this life here. Look at these players. I'm so proud of them knowing where one-ups are and stuff. That's three enemies now for Jeff once he picks up the blues. He needs to find four more coins. What? Ambo, what are you doing? Ambo for oh, he's, to he's use a... the sewer. Yeah. I've done that before. Jeff failing Beyblade. Beyblade's not free. It's not free, and it's honestly not that much worth it. <laughs> Especially if Does you want it... a blue. On the it seems like a second, but it's, yeah, it's, it's, oh, nice it's wall kick. You lose Jeff. a lot more if you fail it, so oh, yeah. Failing Rico 3 is very frustrating, I'll it's say. Very frustrating. I mean, to be fair, it is a frame perfect trick after all. Beyblade's perfect. frame perfect? No, it's not. <laughs> Yeah. Oh no! <laughs> Jeff falling down on his last coin. Is this gonna give Ambo the chance to catch up? I think Ambo Jeff needs... will have it though. Ambo needs to find one more, which I think is on the crane. All right, actually, he might have already got the crane. Oh, uh, looks yeah, like so Jeff so gets Jeff's, it. Jeff's gonna steal this by like ten seconds, if that. Because Ambo just needed this one uh, up here on the rafters. So fortunate. It's not the end of the world though for Ambo because he still has roughly the same amount of coins to Jeff, because he knows he was really close to that goal. He has the same amount of progression, and Jeff has no idea where he is right now. He and is probably tilted. Ambo has, Ambo has one more shine. And yeah, Ambo has one more Delfino shine than Jeff. So Ambo's still probably tilted for losing that goal by like 10 seconds, I would be. But you have to take it as it is. and Leaving right now. I wonder if he's rushing bosses. I really hope he's not going to commit to Bianco, because that would be really bad. Interesting. I don't know. He can get a couple red coins. He could probably rush bosses if he does Serena right now after this, and then get, grab the enemies in Bianco 4. But he has a whole shine lead ahead. With there Delfino, yeah. But yeah, Ambo off to Bianca 2 while Jeff is figuring out this frame perfect spin jump to get into Rico 3 <laughs> cage. Getting his fourth enemy. Yeah, I think Jeff's going to win that too. Because. Yeah, I mean, Ambo can get one enemy in Bianca 3, but he's not. he can't get both. Also, windmill wall kicks are a scam. Except when they're not. As long as yeah, as long as Jeff doesn't die in Rico Four, Jeff should be able to do Rico Five and go to Gelato One before Ambo would finish Bianco Two, Three, and then get both the the, the pokies in Four. Mm -hmm. But it's it's be it would be pretty close. I don't know exactly the timing on that. It's a nice Rico Four. The most Monka S secret. Uh, oh, good ground pound. That was good. Good safety option. Yeah, I think Jeff will be fine, but he has to like not make any mistakes if he wants the enemies. Ramada put a whole bunch of math in the chat. I'm not going to bother reading that because that's way too many numbers. Um, I don't know. Basically, all, all I got out of that was it's going to be close. <laughs> and whoever plays better will probably win the enemy's goal. <laughs> You're Which... saying wh whoever w plays better is going to win. I'm sure. No, never. That's why I win because I suck. 
I'm a buster. But. Ooh, oh, Jeff, Jeff bonking. That might cost him these enemies. Oh, the yeah, I didn't even know oh. about that. Oh, no, Embo, wrong play, dude. You go get the enemies uh, first, and then you do the bosses. Yeah. Wrong play. Wrong play. Oh. Wrong play. All right, I don't I don't really fault him that, though, because it's, it's tough to know if he was going to straight out rush enemies after those 23 or go for the bloopers. Um, This definitely looks like it's going to give Jeff... Five from enemies and two bloopers. Uh, two bloopers, yeah. Meanwhile, Embo will be winning, or I keep saying Embo. Ombo will be winning uh, three boss shines, but he probably delay click it for a little bit after he sees. Um. The two bloopers click. He could probably delay it by like. I don't know, 30 seconds and get a little bit farther out than he would. It's it, like if he assumes right now that Jeff just goes straight to PD, uh, he could probably like finish Manta, finish Manta and like get back into Bianca and then click it or something. And doing like even doing like small 20 second delay clicks can make a difference in a match like this. Where is Jeff? Turning in blues? You still have to unlock Gelato. Yeah, that doesn't really help you. You still need to do gelato. I mean, I guess he could do gelato then uh, slide. He hasn't. He doesn't have beach either. Or beach. That's true. Or underbell. We'll need to. Also, someone needs to pay attention and see if Ombo gets these nokis in the the water out, or not the water, the coin out in the water for Surround Twenty later. It does look like he's doing. He's getting the the water one yeah, at least. Water coin. Water one is always the one I forget in All Blues New Game Plus. And I know for a fact mm -hmm. both of these guys run that category. And also, they really I, don't, like I don't agree with Jeff going to open Gelato. You should have just ran straight to Bianco and rushed three bosses at this rate. I mean, like, this, what, like, out of the starting point, what do you do? You go to Bianco or Rico on this card. So if you don't see them click anything, you can probably guess that they were doing something similar to you. I don't know. That, that, would, that should probably just experience speaking, though. No, he wants to go into Gelato. He... yeah, he just wants the enemy. So now Ombo has a Manta ahead uh, in Serena. Oh, he's going for the Nokis. Good. So Good these day. Nokis, <laughs> if you don't, you can only get them in one and in six. And if you get them in one, then you can get 20, exactly 20 in episode four. Yep. Or by episode four. Yep. If you... If you ignore them, then you either have to go all the way back to episode one or go until episode six. Yep. Which is why it's really important to not forget those, so, especially Ombo, when you're doing efforts. Ombo straight clicking off the boss shines, which is fair. You could probably guess that Jeff might have rushed the bosses after the two bloopers, but Jeff's going to hold this five enemies click now because he knows that Ombo is too busy doing bosses. Oh, going for lives? Yes. There's five blues. Okay, just gonna hold the click, the click for a little bit. Uh, Ombo opening up Gelato now while Jeff has two secrets out of his five. Ooh, Jeff's going to be first in Dependa now. That could be costly. Again, this card just kind of sucks. <laughs> you have to like half commit, to, half commit to everything. Going for Honey Skip? Jelly Skip? This it looked jelly like skip. Jelly Skip. Dude, yeah. if he went for that, he would have got stuck in GBJ. Looks like he got honey skip though. Yep. 
Meanwhile, Ambo opening up Gelato, gonna go do Shine now. So this will be his fourth Delfino Shine. Sounds right. All right, because Slide Beach, Underbell, and uh, Pachinko. Is there a losing pinnacle? No. I think he just wants to. Yeah, just wants blues, which I think they're tied now. (laughs) Jeff turned in 20 blues, so he's at 29. Ambo not even interested in going into into pinna. That's fine for now. What would he be working on? Well, there are a lot of things he could be working on. Oh, he's getting that blue. Oh, f- isn't 15 from... No, 15 from Bianca's not on the card. No. Oh, that's a good goal. But he's probably doing this for... Uh, going five going on. He's doing hundreds. No, I think he was spraying that because he thought the blue came out of there or something. Hundreds would make sense. Okay, yeah. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> Maybe he just wanted the coin. It's a lucky coin. So he's in Bianco 3. Oh, no, he's doing hundreds. Maybe he is doing hundreds. Hmm. 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 Doubt. This is not Two 100 point. is on the card. I mean, I get that, and with five shines from Bianco, but and I just don't agree. Lives, with doing, I just don't agree with doing hundreds on this card. Like it, it doesn't anytime, really seem like anytime a good soon. Time. Yeah. And if you're gonna do a hundreds, I wouldn't say Bianca would be the one to do. And even if you really wanted fifty coins just for the one up, why would you do it in Bianco? Bianco fifty is not that fast. <laughs> it's not Maybe. slow, but it's not fast. You should just do that in Delfino or grab the lives in Delfino. I don't know. I think he's mostly just trying to combine it with these blues to get up to 45. Because he's in Bianca 3 and he entered with 29. I believe there's you can get up to 17 in Bianca 3. So he can have he'll have that sounds right. he'll have enough to get the 45 total if he keeps if he gets all the blues and plus one while working on this hundred. Meanwhile, Jeff is doing Basket Blues. Gonna Basket Blues, yeah. Net himself another goal and let Ambo know that he's in Penna. Oh, oh, the. Did you see that? I the did purple, not. the purple bullet bill got hit in the in the back by another one, and he lost it. Oh, but then funny. another one came around and hit the basket anyway. He didn't get the one all the way around the corner though. Uh, no, he did not. I believe he's setting up for that. Either he's grabbing a blue and running, or not a blue, a purple and running way the heck out there. Yeah, you don't yeah. need to set up that close. You should have gone for the other basket at that point. Oh, well, that's fine. Oh, and another purple. That's going to explode, yeah. Yeah. Ombo still working on his 100 coins, making these pokies work. <laughs> Getting the three coins from the pokies is vital to Bianca 300, so otherwise you have to, like, Subtle for these really sucky coins out over the water. Also, this is a slightly unorthodox route. <laughs> you don't normally go around the, the hill like that. Oh. Alright, just one more for Jeff. So Jeff still really doesn't know a whole lot about where Ambo's. All he been. knows is Ambo did three bosses, which is either two bloopers and PD or PD blooper and Manta. <laughs> it could even be two, uh, two PDs, or a Wiggler. I mean, I, I guess what you said makes much more sense, but there's just no reason to go to Wiggler and like anything past a lot of one is trash. Really, no reason. Like, I can see a lot of one reds just for the the secret plus the red coin count, but 
Oh, there's a life. Hey, he got the pyro chicken life. That won't give you any more coins, dude. Once you get the life, you need to run away. I think he's trying to kill it. <laughs> It'll give you one coin. My bad. Uh, meanwhile, Jeff, what is that? That's his third secret now. Rico four, Gelato one, and Pena two. Mm -hmm. So he needs to find two more secrets. So Ombo's at 38. Not quite all of the blues you can get. I wonder if Jeff will get the rest of his blues here. In pin of three. Maybe. Well, because he's at like 35 right now, I think. Oh, yeah, he's going for the blues. Kind of built thought... on it, yeah. So he's at 36 right now because he traded in 20, so he needs to find nine more. So he might actually end up sniping Ombo to this if Ombo doesn't like hard rush the rest of these blues. Which would be pretty sad. Uh oh. He needs to find four more. Well, I think he has plenty in Delfino to choose. I mean, there's also Bullworn think... and Bianco. Oh, but wait, they're no. pretty far yeah. away. Yeah. I don't know. Hopefully he gets it. Otherwise, he's going to feel really bad about this night. Where's he going? Bonk. Yeah, Jeff needs to find six more. Ombo going to go down in the sewers? Yeah. Get the blues, right? Yep. Okay. I not the not the lies. I don't think he's done the linked, which I don't know, surprised me a little that he would do the link right away. Jeff just needs to find four more coins. Oh, uh, I I think he's gonna get the two M's. Which I can think of right now off the top of my head, which four coins he should get. But I think Ombo will end up winning this, as long as he doesn't delay click it. There okay, is. nice with the, the text box skip. So yeah, Jeff is going to be feeling pretty sad about that one, losing the, the 45 total click. Not really the end of the world for Jeff, because he can still compete with 60 and 80 total. And he has, you know, through pin of 2 done and half of pin of 3. So, I mean, he's right next to pin of 4 sprayless. He's getting another red coin right now. Which, this is his first red coin, technically. No, second. He did Pachinko. Yeah. Um, has access to uh, Pinatou Reds. We'll get Yoshi okay. for Serena. Um, Ooh. And he could do EYG, I guess, for Shadow Mario if he needs to back up to that point. Pinatou is not easy. Uh, but yeah, having difficulty with Pinatou right now. Combo entering Pinna. Not entirely sure. There's the, there's the bird. Is he trying to do sixty right now? That's I can see. That's not a bad play, I guess. Yeah, he knows Jeff has a number of blues and is probably trying to contest for these, these. so... As long as he gets a decent amount in the park right now, he should be fine for 60, depending on what Jeff does. He can get 12 really quickly, and there are plenty of links to go around. To... Ooh, that's a bonk, though. Oh, we're, sh uh, we're shining the game on uh, Jeff's screen right now. I mean, it's even worse because you can't use <laughs> Flood. I mean, you can use not the Spray Nozzle, which you have to use Hover, which means you have to use a sloppy 2-cycle or a really sloppy 3-cycle. In some ways, the fact that you're handicapped like that makes it a little bit less strenuous when you mess up because it's like, okay, I'm handicapped. I expected myself to mess up. 
you feel a little less bad for not getting a one cycle. Yeah. Well, I feel a little less bad. I've gotten like three one cycles in my life. So. I used to get them consistently, and then I stopped playing Sunshine, and then now I can't ever get them again. It's very scam. Turtles are awful. That's what we're shining in the game. All right, Ombo's at like 54 or something like that, so you probably collect the rest with baskets in Pinna 2 or get the rest in Pinna 3. But yeah, Jeff finishing up his Pinna 4 spray list. I did not see him spray, so he should be good, good to get this goal as long as he doesn't spray when getting the shine. Uh, he had the DM shot where he goes through Mecha Bowser's head. This feels bad. Oh. But Jeff making it a 5-2 game right now with that click. So Ambo knows that he's behind in Pena. Very behind. Very behind. But Ambo's pretty much set up for literally anything else better than Jeff is. Good rocket regrab. Oh! Okay, I think he should be good. <laughs> Dude, he almost continued into that two-minute cutscene. That would have been a really bad. But then we get to find out who about... Um, sorry, I don't know why I made Pogo, that so Pogo bad. Pogo wanted the lore so bad, dude, and he almost got it. We get to find out who Shadow Mario really is. If Jeff we, going if back, we get Yeah, to... Jeff going back into Pinna 2 Reds here. Okay. The red. So this will be his third red. And then he could get... Uh, tall grass and lily pad. Lily pad, if he really wanted. So just straight rush reds. It's a good move by Jeff. He'll get two goals out of this, plus some Delfina shines. Assuming this is what he's doing. Yeah. But yeah, Ombo is pretty well set up for two from five because he has Manta already done. Um, maybe that's what he's here for. It's just did, two shines. Did part of Bianco? Is it, is that did part first? of Rico? Yeah, I didn't expect yeah, to see that whole cutscene. So yeah, this is Ambo's first secret. While Jeff's already done with three of them, right? Yeah, Jeff went to Gelato. Yep, that does look like. Yeah, he's gonna go for tall grass. Not a bad play. You get, yeah, you get four reds right after this. You can do, you can open Serena, go to Lily Pad. That's your fifth red. You can finish up eight in Delfino, and then either do Serena or do Noki. Which Serena has three goals and Noki has two. Yeah, now that blooper boss is off the board. Yeah. Eel and what's the other? Four four shines from Noki. Oh, four from Noki, yeah. Which was basically just a straight eel rush. So, well, if you wanted to split those goals, you could get one of them as uh, the hidden. Yeah, you could get the hidden and get Noki three as your fourth. I guess if you're concerned about it, because that is faster than going to eel. But Ambo staying in. Jeff should know that he had to lead through most of Pinna. If he decides to go to Noki after this uh, red coin and Delfino stuff. I think just wrapping up some blues. Yeah, Ambo getting pretty close to his 60 total here. He should be able to get, get it in Pena 3. I think this is Ambo's second red. He did Pachenko, but I think... Yeah, Pachinko, that was it. But yeah, he's a little too late for him because Jeff's already getting his fourth. So that bird was a little bit trolly. I don't know, dude. I just I still not a fan of the hundred play in Bianco. That was just not the, yeah. the call to make at that I point really... in the match. Yeah, I mean, because you're a so far, call. you're you're so far behind in Pena. You don't have Yoshi, which means. You're behind in Serena if you want to do Serena nonsense. You uh, are behind in Shine Count 
probably to Jeff, who means he also has a lead to Noki. Um, I just, it's, come on, dude. It's just tough when you're behind. Oh, he's but, not doing Lily Pad. He's doing Rico 6 or Rico, Rico 4 six. Reds. I don't even mind Rico 6. Yeah, Rico 6. That's pretty cool. You don't see that too often in bingos. Nope. Uh... I don't know. I would have preferred Lilypad just because it's another Delfino Shine, and then he could just yeah. find some really easy Delfino Shines to finish out. Um, but this is fine too, I guess. Yeah, Ombo clicking off his 60 total. So Jeff does not really have a lot of information about where Ombo has yeah. been. He has three boss shines, 45 total, and 60 total. So he can assume that Ombo has been to like at least four worlds. <laughs> I want to see Ombo get 20 lives now. So just the most vague possible goals. Oh, that would be so obnoxious. Or like two 100s. Yeah. <laughs> 10 100s right now. Oh, that'd be awesome. He's just like, dude, what are you doing? I have no idea what you've been doing this entire match. But yeah, finishing up Rico 6. That's his fifth red. So Pachinko, uh, Pin a 2, Pin a 3. Tall grass and Rico Six, so that's five reds. So Ombo going in, gonna do Pin of Four now. He can use the spray nozzle. Um to try and get Still Yoshi. The worst shine. Still a bad shine. Uh let's see what Jeff does. Because Jeff knows that he's behind in blues, but I don't think he really needs to focus on that anymore at this point. You should either get into Serena or Noki, or even try and steal the Bianco goal. Work on two from five. Or Delfino Shines yeah. or something. I don't know. This card's weird. Jeff has two from three. Yeah, this card is weird. Did See. he do the hidden in Gelato? Did Jeff or... Yeah. No, he Cause... didn't. Because otherwise he only has one in Gelato. Oh, okay. I think I was thinking Ombo when I said two from three, but. Yeah, because Ombo has Pinna, Rico, and Bianco, and then one Shine in Serena, which I think Jeff has Rico, Pinna, and then one Shine in Gelato. But yeah, well, Jeff into Serena now, so Jeff might be able to win. Well, I don't know now, All because. three of these goals. Jeff, it... well, it depends on what Ombo does. If he straight rushes Serena, I think Ombo could beat him. Yeah, if Ombo goes straight to the surrender right this instant, gets Yoshi and hops on in and does that, then cool. But if not, and Jeff wins four from Serena, Hundos, and 20, that's three more goals. That puts Jeff at 10, while Ombo will be at like four or five with these Delfino shines. I think he can afford a box game, but he can't afford much else. Maybe, yeah. maybe like a right bell or a left bell, rather. But how many shines is that for Ombo? Five from Delfino? Is that right? Sounds right. It, yeah. So he only needs to find three more, which is like another box game. DeLorean. Yep, he's going to Serena. Looks That's or he could be doing Lily Pad. Or Lily Pad, but if he goes to Serena right now, that would be amazing. And they just like right. rush the rest of these secrets, the twenty and the the hundred. Because he'll also get 200s out of this if he d goes th and does Serena 400s. Well, he's going to Serena. Or opening Ser Oh. Eat the bird, go back. No. 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 You have 20 blues in Serena. Just do that and you'll have 80. Come on, dude. What are you doing? Jeff is not having the best Manta. He's going to chuck Yoshi and go do box game two. Mm, mm, mm. Sad. Well, I don't know. If you're Ombo in this point, like you really have to win Serena. Like, that's three goals that you can't really afford to give up. Because like once you're, if you're down 10-3, it's really hard to make a comeback, especially when you're behind. Jeff knows that right. the so he's Basically at the same point Ombo is with Serena. So he has another chance. He can still beat Jeff. 
but it doesn't look like it. No, I... Oh, he's going no, for Bell. He, yeah, he's doing Delfino Shines right now. Unless Jeff leaves for some reason, but I don't see Jeff later, at least. Because Jeff it, has. Is that a big leak? It, uh, it, looked, it just looked like a momentum spin jump. Ah. Um. Yeah, because Jeff actually is going to get four goals out of this because he could do four from Serena, twenty blues, one hundred in Serena, and then he'll have five secrets at the end of this because he already has three going into Serena, which is four goals, and then Jeff needs to. I don't know. Defeat Shadow Mario. Uh, go to Pianta. I mean, go, go to Noki I... and do Eel, or Four Shines. Double up on that. He will have. He will have the lead on most of these goals, but <laughs> it's not going to be enough. Is this his eighth? This should be his eighth. If he goes back to Serena here, I'm going to be very right. sad. Slide, beach, underbell, left bell, pachinko. Box two box one and, one and two, so that's seven. And then and uh, Chuckster, so that's eight. What What are you doing? There you, okay. Cl clicking the wrong counting. goal. He was oh, counting, he, click he clicked the wrong goal. What are you doing, Ombo? Fine. I, I'm not gonna yell at him. Yeah, almost pulling a Quan there. That's uh, scummy. What do you do? Oh, he's gonna turn in. Turn in. Go to Noki. That's not bad. That's a counterplay to Serena, but you're still not gonna win at that rate. If Jeff grinds out lives in Serena two after he's done with the other Serena goals. Ombo has twelve lives. Last I checked. He just needs to make sure to do it soon. Oh. Jeff, okay, Jeff. Two from five? Oh, Shadow Mario and Pinna? Did that eight? Oh, no, no, no. Really? He, he, wants, he wants the secret. Oh, uh, okay. That makes sense. Yeah. So he's going to do EYG. He's going to do EYG and then into Shadow Mario. That's fine. I mean, so technically, if Jeff does that, he goes through Shadow Mario, Ombo has a chance to still win these three goals from Serena, which would make it a 9-7 game, which would make it a lot more doable. If it comes down to one goal... Dude, why are that's... you fruit storaging from so close? <laughs> Jesus. That goal is going to be four from Pianta. I'm calling uh, it now. He has, he has one too many stews on him. Is that close enough? I don't know if that's close enough. Uh, it barely was. Yo. Look at that train. Oh, uh, don't, don't get on that, dude. Don't get on that, dude. It's going to... I'm this might he might zip. <laughs> he might he's... zip. Why do you say that? He's right. He's facing it. It might despawn before he gets there. That was a little far away. Okay. Oh my god, dude, that was way too close. Ambo being risque here, going and breaking the left side of the wall. I haven't seen anyone do that since I don't know. <laughs> Do people still do that? Over the top to the left. What year is this? This guy's with the throwback strats. Right? Nice momentum spin. Yeah, they're not playing bad. They're just making the wrong calls. <laughs> yeah. It's five secrets. Yeah, so Jeff got his five secrets after not zipping, thankfully. You know, dude, that was really close. I'm scared. I can't believe he got on that platform. I thought for sure that would have zipped him. Um, Ombo, let's see, he finished Serena 2, so making his way to Serena 3, and then 
You can do hundreds in CERN of four and then get a quad click. So that'll put it to nine to eight. Now, where does Jeff go after this? Do, no if key. he goes back, no key. No I was key. thinking if he goes back to Serena, which he might, then that could be hard. That could be a bad decision. That would be a bad decision, especially after he just gave it up to go do Pinna. <laughs> I mean, he did Serena 1 and Serena 2. That's that's a lot. So he might think he already has committed more to Serena. I don't know. I just... Why wouldn't you just stay Pinna at that point and then go to Serena? And then that way you can... You can hold these clicks in Pinna until you're like halfway through Serena and then you're like they're like, oh they're not in Serena right now and then Embo goes Serena, Abo goes Serena, and then Jeff's already in Serena three when Abo's, you know, in Serena two or whatever. Uh, and then Jeff he going you know, Serena? Gets, oh he's going the, Serena. Gets the click. Oh no, Jeff. Uh okay, this hurts. All right, so let's see if Ombo knows how to do Serena twenty after I yelled at everyone last night to learn your Serena 20s. But it looks like he's getting, he's gotten every coin so far on the outside. Yeah. There's two more to get, the one behind and then the torch. We'll see if he combos this with the 100 or if he's not going to bother, but he probably will be doing the 100 here. Yeah. Yep. This is a good play from Ombo. This is the right play to do at this point because you really need all four of these goals in order to make a comeback. So this will be four from Serena. So, I mean, Jeff could steal four from Serena if he just does. Yeah, if he doesn't want the hundred. Yeah, just does Serena four. But that would be a pretty... That'd be a pretty bold call, especially considering how oh, little he knows Technically, Ombo could get a, a quintuple click, because he'll also have 80 total blues at the end of this. Yo. This will that's go down actually, That's three. insane to line up. Do you know how hard it is to line up five clicks at once? That's insane. I already thought it was nuts that he was be able to line up a four click, but he could totally line up a, a, a quintuple click. I do believe that would be a bingo record, at least in the tournament. But I'm just totally speculating. So let's see if Jeff goes for the hundreds here, because if he does, he's already down by like 30 coins and a number of blues. No, uh, he's going for blues. Oh no. I understand. Right. I understand why Jeff is doing this. I do too. I just really wish yeah. if he really wanted, he was concerned about those pinnacles in the secrets, that he should have just done that first when he was at Pinna and then come to Serena. Solid hundred so far. Make sure to not spawn King Boo's out Jeff of bounds. Didn't, Jeff didn't get any of the co the coins outside. Uh, no, he got a, a oh no, the, the, he didn't yellow get coins. yellow oh. coins. He got blue coins. He might be just straight rushing these twenty in Serena and not dealing with the the hundred. Even still, I think he's gonna lose it. Yeah. Because Ambo had what? He had sixty. He had three I when he turned in, I think. So yeah. those three he already had from Serena. So he should be ending this straight at 80 or 20 total. Always forget what is the number you need before going into the casino. And I, I want to say it's like set. 77 or something? I think it's 77. Either that or 76. Before you go into the final tunnel in Noki 200s, it's 78. And before you um, approach the Pianta nose in... Um, or rather, the, the little pool area in Pianta 100s, it's 78. Door clip? Ombo knows how to do door clip. Hype. Nice. Nice. And he knows where the coins are, so he's definitely going to get this goal because there's two here and then two in the casino, which should get him his 20. 
Oh, dude, this is going to be so hype if he gets this. No. Oh. There's no way Jeff does the secret before he finishes his hundreds. But he might beat him to the, to the blues. Oh, is he delaying? I don't think Jeff got every single blue, though. <laughs> he went through the, the hotel really fast. All right, but he. Wait a minute, he's he's at nineteen. He still needs the torch. Okay, I was like, is he missing a coin? <laughs> oh my god, get this the coin. Quin the quintuple? Is this the quintuple? He has twenty. Yeah. He knows how to z menu. One, two, three. three. Don't is he gonna delay. Hold? Is he gonna? He's gonna delay the twenty and the eighty total. Four. No, there's four. Five. There it is. It was a very slow, but he did quintuple click. That was hype. One now of the best plays. Gonna, now he's going to have a lead into Noki. In this entire tournament. And Jeff is going into Bianco. Now, I believe this is going to be almost tech, um, fifth level for two if he goes, if he gets two shines, of course. But Is it? I thought he only went to oh, Rico. Yeah. No, yeah, Bianco. Rico, Rico, Bianco, Pena, Serena, and then Noki. So this will get him two from five once he gets through Noki two. Whereas Jeff needs to do Bianco and then one from Gelato, I believe, because I don't think he got the hidden. I think he only got Gelato one. I think this is GG. I think Abba wins this, right? Because he gets two from five. Four from Noki and Eel. And that's three and goals. And then he could go Jeff get... Jeff just exited area for some reason. He could go get the remaining 20 lives. Four from Pianta. I don't know. But it'd it be is... really hard for Jeff to win if he doesn't win Noki. Which he's already an entire shine behind on. Hi, Jeff. Jeff now, just made... Now that being the said, if Jeff, if if Jeff does the hit in one, two, and three, he'll beat um Ombo to the four. If Ombo does one, two, three, four. But he's currently not going for the hit in. You can go for the hit in in one, two, or four, so it's not this isn't indicative of he's not gonna go for the hit in or not, but normally you go for the hit in just first <laughs> out of anything, because it's just Normally, actually, you do it in Noki, too, because you have more platforms to run across on the water. And that is what he's doing. That's what Amo is doing, at least. So, yeah, if Amo gets this hidden, then there, I think Jeff is screwed. <laughs> like, This will be his two from five. And then two more mm -hmm. shines, he'll get four from Noki. Yeah, Noki two, Noki and three one are really more. fast. And then he'll and get then one more heal. So that's... And that's he's ahead on lives and in yeah. Bianco. Because Jeff exited Bianco. Yeah, and then neither of them touched Pianta this game. But Pianta sucks. Pianta sucks. <laughs> it's That's the worst goal on this card because it has no synergy with anything. Except maybe lives. Alright, that's two from five for Ombo. Bringing it back, it, dude, from like a... What was this? A 9-3 game? 7-3 game? I know it was four... Or nine four, I think. One. Four two. It six, was five two. two at one point. <laughs> it was, it was a lot two. to a little and Ombo brought it back, is what I'm yeah. saying. Ombo is the underdog. Oh. Oh now Jeff does have a little bit of a lead to Eel, but very marginal. And he's going to lose four from Noki. Unless yeah. Ombo does something really weird. Jeff would have to get either the four from Noki or Eel. And snipe him out to 
both Bianco goals. And either get lives or Pianta. <laughs> I'm wondering why Jeff just left Bianco as soon as he got in. I think he realized no key was the play on here. Because it has two goals that are shorter than five from Bianco and defeat Shadow Mario. That's true. Jeff has like what, a ten second lead though into Noki over Probably not even ten seconds. But Embo does have a Bianco lead right now. Tech by one shine, I think, because he didn't do that's, Bianca. That's a long three. shine. That is Bian Bianca too does suck. It's like a minute and a half, two minutes, or something like that. So, this is why I said oh. this card sucks, dude. You have to like half commit to everything. <laughs> uh. And even if Jeff goes for Eel, if he gets chomped once or doesn't get cutscene skip and uh, Ambo gets cutscene skip, then Ambo will also win that. Yeah. So let's say Jeff does take. So Eel. I wonder, I wonder what he's gonna do when he sees Ambo clicking four from Noki, and if he'll wonder that he's gonna try and delay click Eel, or uh... if he'll think that he did the hidden. And then one, two, and three, and then it's going to do eel after. I thought he was hex. Oh, but was hex being area for a second? That would have been, like, would have been why are you bossing? Um, now bringing it to an 11 9 game, we'll see what Jeff does if he goes to Bianco here, or if he's going to just try and go for the eel and hope it's not a delay click. Yeah. Not a delay click. Okay. If I were Jeff, that's the right move, I think, yeah. by Jeff. Oh, Ambo's. Okay. I'm going to win if he goes to Bianco. Yeah. No, don't do live grinding. Go to Bianco. If you're going to live grind, go to Bianco 1. Bad. Mm. 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 Not a fan. Well, by the time the life I grind's mean, over... I, yeah, he's at, like, what, 10 lives or something like that? So, center 2 life grinding is pretty quick. And then he can get into Bianco and do Bianco 1, 3, 4. And he'll have... Uh, Five. Oh yeah, because he has hundreds. Like that. That's only the four. But the insane hundreds that actually made the difference. Yeah. It's only gonna net you one life, dude. You can't jump on the stairs. It's gonna net him zero. That is true. If he, he only gets zero. one life. He only got one one, so net zero. Yeah. There you go. There you go, yeah. One thing I hate about MTSCU is that you have to keep pausing to check your lives your life count. I mean, you could not touch the control stick for a few seconds. <laughs> oh, oh, dude, he got bullied by the stews. I really wanted to see that life fall on him. That would have been awesome. That would have been the best thing I've ever seen. Oh, uh, yeah, no cutscene skip. Not but... getting cutscene skip. So Ambo now back down to 14, which is like where I think he started. I think he started earlier. Okay, three lives. Jeff earlier. finishing out Eel yeah, didn't get were. didn't get cutscene skip, so. But if he goes straight to Bianco here, then he might have a small chance, right? Because I don't actually know. I don't think I think it's straight over now because Ambo gets four here and then just exit area. Yeah, so that's twenty lives, and then goes to Bianco and just does three more shines in Bianco. Or he could just go to Pianta. He could go to Pianta and leave Bianco as a bait, but I mean, Jeff he has just to go he, to he just thought he just saw that Jeff clicked eel, so basically at this point he's just gonna hope Jeff does not have. Uh, I think five Jeff's given up or closer to five in Bianco, and even if he does, then 
Jeff would have to play perfectly at this point. But yeah, Jeff's just kind of running around. He knows that it, once he got the 20 lives, it's over. I always find this part really sad. It's like, Still 12-10, right. so technically he could be playing. Yeah. Oh, doing some wall kicks. So I think he's just going to wait till Embo finishes. Because <laughs> he knows uh -huh. he doesn't... He he knows that he didn't do any of Bianco, and he knows that even if he did Pianta, it wouldn't make a difference. That quince click, though. That's legendary. Early interview? I guess, if he wants to jump in here. I mean, because once he jumps in here, then it's a, it's technically a forfeit at that point, but... Yeah. What's he trying to do right now? Good shit to Ombo, dude. He pulled this back. I thought Ombo was screwed when he did that 100 and was yeah. just, like, doing Delfino stuff while Jeff was in Serena. But then Jeff just McDipped from Serena and then went back to Pena. And that's pretty much what put the nail in the coffin for Jeff, I think, is doing EYG in Pena 7. Um, I think if he had done EYG and Pit of Seven, then gone to Noki, it wouldn't have been as bad. It also, yeah, it would have not have been bad if he didn't go back to Serena. Either stay Serena and don't go Pena, or stay Pena and then go to Noki and don't go back to Serena. Jeff just made one too many wrong decisions in this match. Yeah, I get that, Romato, but. What is that? <laughs> I, don't, face? I, don't, I don't understand doing Serena 1 and 2 and then going back. To Pena to get EYG and Shadow Mario just for the secrets and the Shadow Mario goal. You should have just done that when you were in Pena and then go do your red coins and then go do Serena. It's a lot more fluid that way. What is that face that Jeff put up? I do not know. I still disagree with the Bianca 3 Hondos. That was insane. I can't believe he got away with that. If I were to have incorporated another 100, I would have done Delfino while getting my 8 shines. Yeah, that's probably the play. Delfino 100s with uh, the 8 shines from Delfino. But it did get him an extra shine in Bianco, so he doesn't have to do PD. Or Bianco 3 reds. Well, yeah, Bianco 3 reds isn't slow. No, but I'm tired of seeing that shine. I've seen it like every single match. I kind of agree. I'm tired of seeing Bianco, period. Like I said, though, Ombo's a great player. Um, Jeff is also a pretty good bingo player, even though Jeff's a little bit higher seated. Uh, Ombo is really fast. I think he just needs the experience and the knowledge of bingo to become a great bingo player, but he's... He already has the you know the 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 base tools down. Well, I gotta and say, he, he made that shot. routing decision perfectly with the the quintuple click in uh, Serena. That was the best decision of the game and probably of the tournament <laughs> so far. I gotta say, this tourney is starting off with a lot more upsets than the two v two. All right, thirteen ten, GG, everybody. There's three that I know of. So I'm pretty sure it was a nine to three game at one point. <laughs> That's insane. The comeback, Serena power play. That's what Ombo wrote in the the bingo Dude, chat. Bringing it back from a nine to three deficit is so hard. Shut up, Outlook. <laughs> people in bingo sync hello jeff 
Good well one. played. Well played match, dude. Yeah. I mean, my ending, where I was just learning the Pia the new Pianta movement, that was, I was pretty proud of uh, pretty proud of that part. Can you tell us about the face that is covering <laughs> the life? That's Jeff Co Kappa. Um, I that... was originally just going to use it. So uh, in Serena 2, I actually scripted this because I'm a dork, but... <laughs> In Serena 2, I was, I was going to pretend like I was doing a momentum spin jump because obviously at my level, you probably don't want to do that stuff. Um, <laughs> so I pretended to do it, and then after I put Jeff Cap on the screen for a brief flash, at the end when I was like over, I kind of just put it on anyway. <laughs> so this match, dude, this is a tough one to lose. I, I honestly feel bad that you lost this. Yeah, um, I mean... It wasn't, it wasn't really that you lost this, but more... Ombo kind of brought it back in the perfect way to bring it back, but... I will say, I do think Ombo is a much stronger competitor than me. Um, he, he lacks the experience of Bingo, for sure, but... <laughs> That's what I just said. <laughs> yeah, when it comes to, like, any percent, like, he has a three-minute PB on me, and he's... It's not just any percent speed, but he has definitely the speed advantage over me. Uh, so if my routing is a little bit faulty, it's it's very possible for him to catch up. He's been playing the game for a lot longer than I have, so I, I kind of knew that going in there'd be a chance be losing like that. Uh, so I'm yeah, not, I mean, you were that. you were up to nine to three at one point, and welcome Ombo. Ombo. Um, Thanks. it really just came down to a couple decisions you made towards the late game, Jeff, where you went to Serena and then you dipped to go back yeah. to Pena and get those two goals, and then. That would have been fine if you went to Noki right after that, but going back to no, Serena no, no, no. is what kills you. I understand that was a win con for you if you got all the Serena stuff, but you should have either stayed Serena and then gone back to Penna stuff that you're already ahead to, or no, was, yeah. you should have gone to Noki. It was like a panic. It was kind of like a panic effort. Like, like, oh man, I might not actually have a chance here. Um, you know what can I do? And it was just between a lot of different things, but I definitely should have just raced Noki. Mm -hmm. uh, cause I actually had a pretty solid Noki overall. I didn't get cutscene skip, but my Noki was actually okay. But yeah. you know, it was it was over. But it was long before that it was over. Yeah. Um. Congratulations on your win, Ombo. Uh. Somewhere you'll type, but I don't know how, but you brought this back from a nine to three deficit, which is just insane. Um, you pulled out this insane quintuple click in Serena with the two 100 coin shines, the 100 coin from Serena, the 20 coins from Serena, the four from Serena, and 80 total blues. Uh, that's insane. Insane to line that up and get all those clicks at the same time. Quintuple. You really Rico, <laughs> Rico blues scared you. Yeah, you lost that by 10 seconds. That was unfortunate. Uh, yeah, Jeff, so basically you guys had the same route initially. Did a little bit of Delfino, went to Rico, playing a bunch of Rico. Um, Jeff ended up winning the Blues just by just a hair. And then kept going through Rico, which made Ombo leave to go to Bianco and do some Bianco stuff. Yeah, Rico Rico unlock with Pachinko does not work, unfortunately, because you don't view the whole cutscene. So yeah. Ombo, Ombo lost a minute to that. Well, yeah, Jeff, you great. lost probably. Jeff, you probably lost a minute to your plunder bill. I <laughs> or your, was your practicing underbill. that before the match. I was so, I was so upset. I ended up getting that because I was practicing right before the match. I got it like three times in a row, and I was like, "Okay, cool, we got this." So and the match happened, and I was just kind of like, I was definitely nervous. I, I would say I was definitely nerve, nervous. Mm -hmm. I'm sure, my nerves, I shine through in a lot of ways. Yeah. But it was that, um, and then I had a pretty sloppy pachinko, but I did want to try to get some red coins. So yeah, Ombo traded the bosses for the enemies, which gave him a little bit of the lead in Serena, which you initially took back once you went to Serena, Jeff, but then you gave up to go to Serena, uh, Pinna. Yeah, and that was definitely my my mistake. Um, it definitely cost me the victory. So I so glad I don't forget where Serena and Tony were. Kappa. Yeah, I'm glad too. <laughs> Didn't pull a sniper. I, I, I actually forgot, <laughs> so that's why I actually went for Serena 4. I, I noticed that you didn't get all the blues. I'm like, I don't think Jeff knows where all these blues are. <laughs> uh, I actually, I learned routes. I learned Pico and Noki for this, but I, for some reason I just glossed over Serena. And, and that's that's part of it, you know, if you don't remember everything. Like you're, yeah. It's definitely always something that can come on the card that you don't expect. Ombo, I have so one. That's on me. Anyway. Yeah. 
Um, but I have one really big question for you. What made you decide to do Bianca 300s? Because you are honestly extremely lucky to win this match while doing Bianca 100s when you did. It ended up working out for you, but it was very close to not working out for you. <laughs> you just wanted to do it for one of the 200s. Okay. I, I guess it did net you two lives and a, a shine from Bianco. Um, I cannot believe you did Bianco 300s when you did. That was insane. I wanted to I wanted to bring up a point that we were talking about earlier. Jeff, at one point, the only goals that Ambo had were blue totals, three bosses, and eight from Delfino. Were you were you wondering like where the hell is my competitor? Because I can believe how far Ambo was able to go in without giving away any crucial information. Uh I was I figured he just wasn't in Pinna, but I didn't think he was in Pianta. I, I just, I, I, it was more like places I knew he wasn't rather than. Well, mm -hmm. he was in Pinna. He did do Pinna. Well, I was like, like not contesting the goals I was going for. No, so. you were way ahead in Pinna when you were doing Pinna yeah. stuff. He, he came in. Ambo came in a little bit later to Pinna, but did do through uh, Pinna 4. Mm -hmm. So. I assume Ambo didn't plan that, but if he did, Blue Totals were not to give him any info. Is this Bry guy number two? <laughs> hey, that's already me. Romato said I'm, well, Romato said I'm Bry guy Jr. I thought for Noki would scare him away from Eel so that I could get lives. See, that was the thing. It was either 50 50. Either Jeff thinks. Oh, he clicked four. He's gonna delay click eel. I should go work on something else. Or he clicked four. I just have to hope he doesn't get eel and then go do eel. And Jeff picked. I needed to do eel. Yeah, I mean, I was actually planning to do the same thing. I fi I figured he was a Noki anyway. But if I saw like eel light up, then I would have gone for uh, bird. Or, or I mean, um, if I saw four light up. I would have gone for eel. Yeah. Uh, Jeff did not have any Pianta progress. Neither did you. No one touched Pianta this entire card because Pianta sucked. On this card, this card sucked. Good. By the way, I feel bad for both of you. Pianta sucks, anyways. But yeah, on this card, this this is this is the card you want to see in Scrim Week again. Not something you want to play in a match because it's just hard to to route into uh, to effic efficiently do when there's a lot yeah, of I mean, wishy washy half commit full commit stuff. All I'll say is, you know, I did for a lot of people who were like Jeff, you got this. This in the bag against Ambo, but I I never counted Ambo out completely. It was one of my things. Like he's been playing, he does he's been playing longer than me. He's been doing he does way more categories than me. Like I'm only mm -hmm. I'm mainly eighty percent. I I never really got comfortable with like you know the idea that um like I was never like oh yeah I'm gonna destroy Ambo. Like even in our scrims when I got four to thirteen, I was like I know with Ambo some routing knowledge he could definitely you know take a step on me and. Definitely deserve this win, so I just want to say GG on both because I didn't. I never thought this was like my match, a hundred percent. Like I thought, like mm -hmm. I knew I was a little bit favored going in, but I never was like, I was never like, oh yeah, I'm hundred percent gonna win. Yeah, it's, so, it's a given. I just want to say GG on both. You did really good. So yeah, congrats to both of our competitors, Ambo. You'll be moving on to play the aforementioned Bry guy in <laughs> winners round two. Well, Jeff, not out of the tournament yet. You're down to losers. You get a buy from round one, so you get to play the loser of Pogo and Haru whenever they play their match. Cool. Yeah. So that is going to be all from us at Sunshine Community for today. We had a lot of matches today, a lot of bingo. Join us back tomorrow for the final two matches of Winner's Round 1, uh, where I play against Arceus at 4 p.m. Eastern, I think. <laughs> Um, that one. Am I? I don't remember. Uh, Reed versus Papacino at 6 p.m. Eastern. So, uh, yeah. If no one else has anything else to say, that's going to be it from us. So, thanks everyone for watching.